When every line of a table of contents is double-spaced, it can become difficult for your reader to immediately comprehend it. In this table of contents, every line is double-spaced. That can make it easy to differentiate these short lines, but harder to differentiate multi-line titles. So we're going to single-space each item and then place a double space between each item. First, we'll select a bit of the table of contents by clicking and dragging. And then we'll go to the References tab to the Table of Contents tool. From there, we'll choose Custom Table of Contents. In the window that appears, we click Modify. In the window that shows up after that lists all of the levels of your table of contents. We're going to work first on the first level, our chapter level. We'll click Modify. And in this window, we'll choose Format, Paragraph Settings. Here, we'll change the spacing between paragraphs, between items in our table of contents. So we go to the spacing and set before to zero points before each item, 12 points after each item, and then each item itself will be single-spaced. We click OK. And OK again. And now we'll do that with the second level of our table of contents, the section headings. We'll modify that. Just as we did before, we'll go to the Format menu and choose Paragraph. And we'll modify the spacing for each paragraph, each item in the table of contents. Zero points before, 12 points after, single spaced for each item. And we click OK and OK again. And lastly, we'll do that third level, our subsections in our table of contents. We'll modify that, go to the Format menu, format the paragraph settings to put zero points before each, 12 points after each item and each item is single-spaced. OK, OK, and OK to close out of this, and OK again. We'll replace that table of contents, yes. And there we go. Each item is single-spaced with a double space in between, making it much easier to scan through our table of contents.